Hi everyone, so this is my first video and what I'm going to be calling my road to Articon. Um, I want to put together a couple of videos just really on my experiences of um, preparing for the tournament. I um, bought the ticket um, a couple of days ago. I have absolutely no experience of Lord of the Rings gaming. I had absolutely no models and I haven't even got a copy of the rulebook. I've been watching the Great British Hobbit League videos for a while now, so I've got a very, very basic understanding of the rules. And luckily a friend of mine is really into the um, game and's at a tournament this weekend, so I'm hoping I can learn a bit off him. So I've entered um, entered myself in for the um, tournament. There's actually going to be three separate events. So there's, I think what they're calling Chaos in Arda, which is a 400-point individual tournament there's then a grand tournament and world team championships which is 600 points and then a doubles game which is 350 points per player so i've got to between now and october i've got to put together at least a 600 point force and learn the rules and paint them all because there's no way i'm going to turn up to a tournament like this without painting my miniatures at least i think there's something like 140 people going so it's going to be big and it will also be the first tournament i've ever been to so like i say into the deep end i'm gonna try not to drown but anyway so i'm going for a force of rohan um as you can see here i've got so far my force includes 12 warriors six riders as i mentioned in one of my other videos i had a bit of an issue with um, getting hold of the riders i bought a couple of other sprues off ebay and some are broken, some are okay. In total, I'll be able to put together six riders. So that's what I'll have so far. Um, I think the base points for a Warrior Rohan is six. Yeah, Warrior Rohan is six. You can max them out with Warhorn, throwing spears, bow, shield, banner, and stuff like that. And it comes to 55 points. But that's basically what I'm going to have to start working with. Um, I want to try and get hold of an Urken brand, definitely, so I can upgrade to Westfold Red Shields um, because they get a much better um, stat line. My friend who's going also has a, um, they're very rare as well, a Amir Knight of the Pelennor model. And from what I understand, his is unpainted. And he quite likes the way I paint my miniatures, so I'm hoping, fingers crossed, um, that he might be willing to lend it to me in return for me painting it. That, of course, depends on what sort of force he's going to take. Hopefully, we're going to double up and... I don't know. Hopefully, I won't let the side down too much. But this is going to be my first one. So this is what I've got so far. Um, I'm going to be building my army, putting it together, painting them as I go, and just kind of showing off where I get to. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you all soon. Bye for now. Bye.